Hey, 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 how's it going, everyone? I am your host, WogoZ, and welcome to another video. I guess it's sort of tired already, so grab a drink, sit back and relax, because you know what time it is. It's unboxing time. And today we're going to unbox the foldable mobile phone holder. I know it's white and gray, so you can't really tell, but this is the box. Let's do it. All right, so front and back of the box, they are pretty much the same. Um, so the back is a little bit more in Chinese than in English. Um, the front is full in English, as you can see. And um, it says multifunction box, foldable mobile phone holder, remote control. And then you have fill light two sides free angle shoot up to three hours a thousand milliH battery full angle shoot height of 130 centimeters and foldable on the side we have aluminium alloy tube anti-slip silicone rubber strong metal balancing weight then you got the product number and on the other side, you have, you know, the three different stands. Now, let's open the box. Let's see what we got inside. Full disclaimer, I haven't opened this yet. <laughs> so hopefully Amazon, please tell me that it's working. <laughs> hopefully. Showing the lag. Okay, so we got a micro USB cable. I guess it's for charging. And then let's have a look. What else is in the box? Nothing else, as you can see. Nothing else in the box. Let's put the box on the side. You have... Right, so you got a manual that is mostly... Okay, so one side is Chinese and the other side is English, as you can see. Hopefully you can see a bit better. This is the reason why in the first place. Right, so... Let me see. Anyway, so this is the reason why I bought this. <laughs> because my cameras, when I do unboxes, they're very, very weird. Um, so I hope this will change that. Now, um, most of it is in Chinese, but you have the English translation. It says zero one, push forward to open. Then you have pull out telescopic tube, rotate handle to lock, take out remote controller to connect your phone, put your phone in clamp, adjust telescopic tube height. So it basically tells you what to do. And then you got zero seven, fully extend the telescopic tube and make sure the bending part be pulled out completely all right so make sure this pulled out completely bend forward to form nearly 90 degrees then you have 360 degrees rotate to adjust high angle shoot tips hide the bending parts in the telescopic tube when we use the product in upright status if it will be more stable and firm. Okay. All right. Let's see if... Uh, oh, nice packaging, actually. Um, this feels very strong packaging. That's good. This thing is... Wow. Must be, I don't know, a couple of kilos. It's very, very um, <laughs> heavy. All right, so... Okay, it was just, all right, so, by my understanding, hopefully understood, right? Yep, just push it with your thumb, push it back with your thumb, and then it opens. Oh, wow. Boom, boom, and then you lock it in place. You got your little remote here that you just have to slide it out. Slide it out from the... And you can charge it with the USB-C. Now, to extend it, you turn it and you pull it up. Turn it again. Oh, 
have to turn this down and that blocks it but if we want to keep going up you have to so this turn 360 degrees and so you just have to pull it it takes a little bit of force all right so this looks like the top that it can go you can't see that okay so at the top you got the two flicks and then you can put your phone here oops so you put your phone in here if it okay so this is great because if it's my iphone 12 pro max which is a massive phone so it will fit your phone as well it will definitely fit your phone as well now we want to make sure because the phone is is on top of there you want to make sure that you fix it in place and then oh okay it feels a little bit flimsy keep in mind that my phone is massive so maybe one of the reasons so a little correction <laughs> it does extend a little just a tiny bit more look at that you have to keep pulling until it you feel that it doesn't it doesn't go anymore it doesn't go anymore and th this is it doesn't even fit into the shot look at that it doesn't even f barely fits into the shot so this is the full length you can who this is gonna be tricky <laughs> you can bend it this way let's see if i can make it into the shot yep so you can bend it so you can get those crazy shots and let's put the phone on mine is going into <laughs> all right yeah i no, i don't want to turn it off <laughs> i don't want to turn it off there you go so that's the full extent to make it fit into the shot i'm gonna just make it a little bit shorter all righty so it fits in in the shorts i am curious because my phone is very heavy um so i understand why it's going a little bit down took a little bit to figure out <laughs> i have to say um it's not as easy as it seems so now um in the instruction says that with uh heavier phones you may want to put something on top of the base because it could collapse on one side um and another thing that i found is the top right um so it, it keeps your phone in place but sometimes um when you put it like this way or even full long and tilted um if the phone is too heavy this bit at the top it just goes down like this um i tried with my iphone 12 pro max which is a very very heavy phone and it was doing it um i have an old iphone 11 lying around so i tried it, i'm trying it now so when you go full length and you tilt it with with the iphone 11 too that is semi light it kind of tilts it too much but if it just keeps it like this it does work so there's one thing to keep in mind that if your phone is heavy um so either you have a samsung apple 
uh, maybe a ROG phone, because we're all <laughs> gamers and streamers here, right? <laughs> so uh, just keep that at the back of your mind um, that it may be too heavy. But other than that, it's kind of sturdy. Um, it does come with the lights. I had to connect to it because I literally just received it. And um, it does work. So you just have to connect a little remote through Wi-Fi to your, um, to your smartphone. And then you're able to control the lights. So you hold down and it will turn on the lights. It will turn on the lights. Come on, don't fail on me. <laughs> Come on. You just wept. <laughs> it took me a little bit to figure it out. But, um, gee, come on. Seriously? It, it does have some button on the sides. Let me take the iPhone 11 off first. We don't want to break it. So I'm going to turn it for the camera. You have a USB port at the back and you have one button to go down and another one to go up. And that is connected to the light. Okay, so you got the light at the top. And that's how you make it bright. You change the colors, uh, different temperatures. And then this will go back. The other one will go for... The bottom one, so if for some reason, right, as you can see the bottom one, so you can use both of them, uh, depending on the content that you're making. Um, you can have your phone camera facing this way and using the top light. You can have it face down and using this light. This one is tunable, so you can have your phone you can have your phone inside like this, right? Make sure you fix it in place properly and have it face down with the light right here. So it's a very, very convenient little tool. Um, I will probably rate it 6 out of 10. I like it. I really, really like it. This is one of the gadgets that I've been waiting to find for a long time. The only reason why I'm not giving it any higher is because of the top. So I do understand there's a complicated mechanism, but just maybe a piece of plastic on both sides. Let me see if I can show you what I mean. Stack this for now. So you see here at the top, right? So here it bends, right? just having some sort of way to block it or maybe you own already this product if you know how to fix this please slap it in the comments i will be happy to add it at some point into the video like later on doing down the track um if this would have been more sturdy at the top i probably would have given it an eight because the building construction is fine. Um, keep in mind that this was less than 50 bucks um, US. So it, it, it's a good product for the price. Um, and because of the idea, it could have been a lot more money, but it's, it's a very good product. My only complaint is this, that bends. But other than that, guys, um, it, it's a really good product. Um, I will have an Amazon link down in the description below. The background, beautiful face. <laughs> guys, as mentioned before, um, if you do have any clarification about the little problem that I found, please slap in a comment. If I missed something or you reckon something can be explained a little bit better, pop it again in the comments. I'll be happy to do a follow-up or just reply to the message. Guys, don't forget to subscribe. Over 80% of you, as you can see here, 
and not subscribe so please make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell so you'll be notified next time that I upload the video now let's go back to the video I appreciate you got that far into the video I stream most Fridays at 8 p.m. Australian Central Standard Time so if you have any question pop and stream and ask I don't buy it all the links are down below in the creator side until next time happy creating